We're gonna be mermaids! Hey guys and welcome to Just the Castle. For today's video, I'm very excited because we are going to be transforming into the Little Mermaid live action 2023. I am so excited because I have not seen the movie yet, but I've heard great reviews and Halle Bailey as the Little Mermaid is everything like i literally love her voice i wish i could be her i have an atrocious voice i'm gonna say her ears so you don't have to hear me sing because my voice is literally atrocious so today we're gonna be transforming ourselves into mermaids so right now we're sitting here because i'm going to be doing my makeup first and then we're going to be doing accessories and outfits and yeah i'm so excited basically i already turned myself into a mermaid before and it was to take a photo and i loved it i literally loved it i could do that look all the time i literally know what i'm gonna be for halloween a mermaid there we go little mermaid but yeah don't forget to like this video if you really truly enjoy it and subscribe for some more disney content okay so i already have foundation on guys my hair has seen better days i apologize i literally washed it two nights ago so it's like kind of getting there but it's not quite there yet so i already have foundation on i use the nyx bear with me blur foundation and this stuff amazing i think the shade is yeah it says it right here it's caramel we love caramel it literally looks like caramel now that i'm thinking about it i guess i look like caramel so we have foundation on that's just really up to you. Like if you want to put foundation, if you don't, I completely did that step off camera just because it's not really essential, but it's there. So we have the base. I'm thinking of putting powder on. This is the Fasanti powder. I don't really think there's a name, but the packaging I will say for this is really weird. Like opening it, I don't know. You have to press it and then voila. I'm gonna use my camera as a mirror. So we're going to put on foundation. I mean, not foundation, powder. Kind of makes me look more awake which is good honestly you can't really tell on camera but yeah it's coolio that's a new thing i've been saying coolio then i'm gonna go through this really fast because i don't want this to be a whole makeup video we have the Vasanti brazilian tan it's upside down my phone is ringing the brazilian tan i think this is a bronzer i'm not really sure we're gonna use this brush Coolio. We're getting on to the fun part, eyeshadow. I'm not gonna hold it up because there's so much powder that it's about to spill, but we have this palette. Normally you see me with my Amazon Spotlight palette, but I wanted to use up this because it's cool and you know, it's drugstore eyeshadow, but it works. Here are the colors. I'm thinking we do like an ombre or like a gradient. So we do like blue and then purple or maybe purple and the blue. No, let's do blue and then purple. I feel like that makes more sense. Okay, we're gonna use the only blue shade. <laughs> and then I think for purple, we're gonna use this. Let me just put the blue on first. Coolio. That is done. And then we're going to put some, oh, I didn't even show you what I'm using. The Tinted Balm. It's the Burt's Bees Tinted Balm, if it'll focus. There we go. Okay, so this one comes out watery. I wouldn't recommend it, but it's the only one I have. I lost my other ones. How sad, you know? I hate when I lose my lip balms because the balm is essential, guys. Like, it's, it's literally essential. So, here's a finished makeup look. Now we're getting into accessories, hair, outfit, that kind of deal.
Okay, so obviously we're dressing as Little Mermaid or Ariel in her Little Mermaid outfit. <laughs> so I have the outfit ready. I just want to show you guys what it looks like. Also, my eyeshadow like literally is perfection. I love it. We have this corset. I literally love this, guys. Like it literally looks like Ariel's bralette. I'm not even joking. And then we have, I don't have darker green, which I wish I would have gotten that on Chop Cider instead of these. So we have, don't mind, this isn't zipped up, but these pants, these trousers. I'm gonna go try this on and then we're going to figure out what accessories to wear. You guys, I have the outfit. I didn't shave, so I'm not gonna raise up my arms. But yeah, if you're gonna wear like a top like this, I would say wear either a strapless bra or a clear straps or like a beige bra, like something like that. Just because I've had some from dance, but I don't know where they are. So this is just gonna have to do for now. But I really love this because it kind of like this part, this top part kind of goes in like a sweetheart neckline. So I really like that. You know what? Halle Bailey's hair is curly too. So not mad about that. Not mad about my hair. So it looks like I did come from the pool, which is kind of vibey. So I'm not going to do anything to my hair. I was going to put braids, but you know, it's fine like this. Kind of curly already. So I do not want to do anything else. So I have these flowers that I used. Actually, I think I'm gonna use just the blue one because it kind of gives ocean vibes. So we're gonna put that in. Literally have been using this camera as a mirror, but it's okay. Vibe with it. Cute. And then I have this like little pouch for my necklace. It's so cute. Then we have this necklace, this little... I don't want to raise up my arms because I literally did not shave. If it'll focus, there we go. It's like this blue kind of necklace. So I'm gonna put this on right now. Okay, we have this necklace. Here's the mermaid look. And then what else? Do, oh, of course, Mr. Flounder. Now he doesn't look like Flounder from the live action, but I figured since I have him, might as well use him. So he's so cute. I got him on AliExpress, literally so cheap. And I think they also have Pascal in the same like kind of style. So if you want that for a Rapunzel look, you could do that. I might be doing a Rapunzel look for grad. So stay tuned for that. I don't know if I'm going to buy him because I literally am broke. Now we're gonna head downstairs so I could show you the complete look okay everyone is downstairs so we're gonna do it here here is a completed look i'm obsessed with it i literally love it and i love how pastel it is too and yeah blonder just adds a nice touch to it but yeah that is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoy and cue outro. That is the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoy. Let me know in the comments below. What is your favorite part about being a mermaid? My favorite part is the fact that you get to swim with sea creatures like a beluga whale or a stingray. The possibilities are endless. Yeah, so that's my favorite part. But thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.